Hi fellas, welcome back, right? There's a lad on Facebook called Robin and he sent me a message on Facebook saying send me your dress, I'll send you some dodgy plastic bits. And what he sent is some 3D printed parts and the thing about these parts is like the rare parts and if you find them, even if you manage to find them, you're going to pay like big money for some of these bits. So if you're not bothered about it being I mean, they're not even copy parts, they're just 3D printed. I've got all kinds here. Let me leave the box out. That's empty. In this bag, the first one I've picked up is Sierra Escort Cosworth bumper clip. Now, ah, I know what these, what they, where these go. I might actually need some of these. Anyway, these are 3D printed, right? And they're quite, quite flexible. So they're not going to like snap when you use them. I'll show you where these go. Right, now if we just come down here and we pop this indicator out. Right, we'll remove this genuine Ford clip. It's about 30 year old and we'll try not to snap it. Get the screwdriver and put the little bits in. There's the old Ford clip out. That's still fairly soft, that hasn't gone brittle yet. But this will be 33 year old, this bit. So, we've got the 3D printed part and the original Ford part here. We might, we might as well try it on. Let's have a look. I didn't, I've never took these off before, so I didn't even know they gone on. I'm going to guess, right? Must go that way. That goes in there. That just pops up there. I think I might have to clean all this, it's minging, isn't it? <laughs> that fits absolutely perfect. That's a 3D printed part. How much is that part? He sends a price list. I want to swap it back over. That's unbelievable, that like, really is. Let's see what else we've got, right? Like literally, do you know now, 3D printers. You can get them from like Kerry's and like PC World and that. But not only that, they can actually print metal now. So I mean, in the future, you could be printing like car exhausts or radiators. Technology man, just moving fast, isn't it? We've got a clip for the bulkhead, for your wiring. These are hard to get hold of now. What else have we got? RS500 lower spoiler end clips. Oh, that's for your boot lid, that man. Yeah, I'll show you. I'll show you where these go. I think, I think I know where they go. These go up here and hold this rubber spoiler on. That's mad, that, that's mad, that. How many did you get in the pack? Must be just two. One for each end. Whatever, Let's see what we've got. Sierra Escort Cosworth bumper fog light clip. I need some of them, I need some of them. I've got some fog lights to seal. Let's miss the knees. What else have we got? Power steering pipe bush. All like it rare parts. Mark wants you have a cover screw for the boot. Ah, oh, shut up man, I need one of these. See that? Oh shit. Alright, you see that? Goes in there. To hold this cover on. Right, what else have we got? <laughs> I'm fixing my car there, yeah. Three door cars with three rear body kit. Aye. These are for the plastic rear arches on the car. I trimmed mine with an angle grinder about 10 years ago, so they're no use to me. Now here's a part that's hard to get hold of, right? These are the caps for the spoiler on a three door cosy. So you get a full set. What I will say is, right, the finish is a bit, I wouldn't say rough, but it's not smooth. So I mean, you would, I might need a little bit of just, I mean, you're talking like two minutes of just a bit, bit rubbing on a bit uh, wet and dry. But once it's painted, you never know. I'll show you where these go. These caps go here on the spoiler. I'll take mine out, but if I chip the paint, that's, that's kind of fucking knackering it, do you know what I mean? How many is that? One, two, three, six, seven. I think there's just seven. How many's in the bag? Two, seven. So you get a full set of caps. These caps, if you find them on eBay, ah, you fucking dirty bastards. These caps, right, I've seen these sell on eBay for like, Literally 50 quid each and there's seven of them, so that's like 350 quid for some tiny little plastic caps. Unbelievable. 
Now I know some people out there, right? They'll be saying, Adam, they're good, but they're not genuine. And I totally understand that. If you've got like an original car, or you, some people are just fussy. Like me, I don't care. I would put these on my car and it wouldn't bother us. But some people prefer genuine Ford parts. But if you can't get the, the genuine parts, this is definitely, definitely the next best thing I would say. And they're not that expensive. I think a set of these caps is about, I'll have a look, two seconds. Right, so can you remember I said, one of these caps, people are paying 50 quid for a genuine one. You get seven 3D printed ones for 38 quid. Like imagine years to come, like this is still brand new technology. What they're going to be printing, what they're going to be printing. They can print metal now, even like stainless steels, titaniums, ink and else. But that's it fellas, if you're interested in these parts, I'll leave a link to, I didn't even, it didn't even tell us how to get in contact. Let's have a look. This isn't like a paid, out, paid thing. You just said, Adam, can I send you some bits? Right, where do you see it? Can I send you a parcel? Parcel, looking for the inside. Right, he's only got a Facebook page and an eBay, eBay listing page thing. So I'll leave a link to one of his eBay listings if you're interested, or you just want to look. As far as I'm aware, he's only doing Cosworth parts. I don't think he's doing like other brands at the minute. Maybe there's people out there who are. Like if you want bits for Subaru, I don't know if he'll do them. You can try messaging him. I didn't know, I didn't know. There's maybe people out there doing them. Maybe they're not rare enough yet and the prices are still fairly cheap. But like I say, I'll leave links to Robin's Facebook page and eBay listen thing below. Uh, I'll leave a link to my Instagram if you want to check that out. And until next time, I'll see you soon. Cheers.